The latest from Baton Rouge, a city on edge after authorities arrest three suspects for plotting to kill police officers. Another suspect still on the loose in a city already tense from that fatal police shooting of Alton Sterling. ABC's Alex Perez has the latest. This morning, a manhunt underway in Baton Rouge for a remaining suspect who authorities believe was part of a plot involving at least three other men to kill police officers in this Louisiana city. We took those threats as being credible. Police arrested two men and a 13-year-old boy after a burglar attempt at this pawn shop. The men allegedly stole eight handguns and were seeking ammunition to take down officers. It was going to cause harm. Uh, to police officers in Baton Rouge area. This threat comes on the heels of the shooting death of Alton Sterling last week by Baton Rouge police. That shooting caused a week of chaos here, which saw hundreds of protesters arrested and led many to question if police were too heavy handed. But law enforcement officials say it was this threat to kill officers, why they took such aggressive tactics. Very real and viable threats against law enforcement. Look what happened in Dallas. A very peaceful protest, and then some crazy madman did what he did. And authorities say they have recovered six of those eight stolen handguns. The search for that fourth suspect ongoing. George? Okay, Alex, thanks very much.